CIC Health has launched its second Massachusetts and 15th in New England public COVID-19 testing site at the Riverside MBTA station in Newton. This is a drive through operation with the gold standard PCR test. It's not what used to be the old big Q-tip that sort of uh, went all the way to your brain. It's actually uh, a small Q-tip that just goes about half an inch into your nose, self-administered, do it yourself on both sides of your nostrils and that's it. And the people stay in their car, they don't even need to get out. Uh, and it's uh, adults and children as well. In order to get tested, you must make an appointment by visiting the CIC Health website. The reason we do this is we don't want to have long lines. Uh, so for, for today, Wednesday, we're already sold out. And as you can see, it's just a couple of cars coming in every 10 minutes. They basically drive in, we want them to do the test and be out. 120 appointments a day are available seven days a week from 7 a.m. until 7 p.m. the first week with the capacity ultimately rising to 500 per day over the next couple of weeks. Insurance is not accepted at the moment, but the cost of $80 is less than the other test sites of $120 or more. We actually from the beginning tried to offer this PCR test at the lowest possible price as opposed to how much a uh, company can get reimbursed or how much the government is willing to pay. We actually decide to start the other way, which is what's the cheapest test we could offer of really high quality. Uh, and that's how we're able to offer to offer this price. Results are available in 24 hours. The tests are processed at the Broad Institute of MIT and Harvard. So we take all of these to this afternoon. We, all, we take them to our offices. We make sure all the documentation is correct, hand them over to the Broad Institute. They process them and results are on average around 24 hours. So we like to say 24 to 36 hours or 24 hours on average. CIC Health will also be administering COVID-19 tests to teachers and staff working in person at Newton School buildings. We are doing already some testing in Newton in some schools and we're also doing uh, the other, other schools around in different towns, Waterton School District, uh, Vermont. We are doing all the testing in the state of Vermont. Uh, we just opened a site in Providence, Rhode Island and three more coming in Rhode Island. So we're doing what we can to, um, to basically open as many places and support as many people in their testing all across New England. There are free testing sites available by visiting the mass.gov website. There's the stop the spread uh, test sites, of course, uh, that are covered. And we, of course, encourage everybody to go wherever they can, whatever's closest to them or more convenient to them. Uh, we think that we need all of the different testing uh, uh, modules and facilities as we can to get as many people tested.